Welcome back to the channel. Today we are reviewing from the 2019 top pick series, Seth Rollins. I know I am four years late on this as a film. Uh, depending when you're watching that, it's going to be a lot longer. Might be a bit longer than that. But anyway, I bought this in a bundle lot. Uh, so, you got here. The only other accessory you get, well, you get... Two, like, mic holding hands. For Seth. Uh, I'm more likely not going to really display him. I mainly bought him for that Monday Night Rollins show. Which you can see here. He also has come with two fists. The Monday Night Rollins t-shirt. Removable on the back. He does not stand. Like, he falls over. I don't like that. Uh, but anyway, there's a Monday Night Rollins t-shirt. Logo there. I don't remember if he wear him this much. I think he wore maybe for a few shows, but rather than that. Then we got the gear. This is like green, lime green, and black with the belt. I do like the belt tension detail I did put on this. I do like the knee pads themselves. But I'm not a fan of this head. It is an awful Seth Rollins head. Like, so that sit down a way lot. If it was like any other the Seth Rollins heads that we've had, had, even the ones that didn't have true effects, it would have been a lot better. But for me, that really boosts it down. Um, if you saw this at the time, I would have said not to buy it, like 2019. But now, if you find it cheap. Like, how much I paid? I think I paid two quid for this. Well, no, I bet bought a lot for 20, but they wanted two quid for it so much. So, anyway, uh, yeah, I'd give it a 5 out of 10. Mainly because of the gear. He has got his tattoo on the back. But if you can do a head swap, do a head swap. Because that is awful. But, anyway. Uh, 5 out of 10, in my opinion. The head ruins it way too much. But anyway. Like, comment, subscribe. Help me out a lot. Thank you. I'll see you next one.